Hi everybody, and today we're here in Destin, Florida, and we're here at Fud Puckers. Say that three times. Okay guys, let's do this. This here is Jake. He's 15 feet long and weighed over a thousand pounds, right? Yes. Yes. Wow. And he's actually real. This is just a casting of what he looked like. Um, that's crazy. Oh wow! There's a there's a bunch of gators down there, and these kids over here they got like fishing sticks and they're trying to catch gators. That's probably not a good thing to do. So we're gonna go in and eat here and um, really a colorful colorful place of course there's there's a pit full of alligators in the middle of the restaurant but this is gonna be very interesting uh, you know Chris we've ate at a lot of risk interesting restaurants around here haven't we, we have. yeah ever since we've been yeah. hanging on Destin yeah that's been crazy crazy places so it looks like you get the right on the walls here but um you got some t-shirts and lots of color yeah. here's the bar So this is the menu. It comes in a, a newspaper. Of course, uh, the owner here oversees the uh, widening of the, the road here, which is very well needed due to the fact that this area has big traffic jams. But anyways, um, got some um, upcoming um, activities here. And in the center of this is the food and drinks. They got frozen frozen mm -hmm. options, specialty drinks. They um, have crab balls. So they got a lot of different um, no, drinks here. Here's their um, menu. They got appetizers, munchies, fresh salads and soups. Um, get loaded, shrimp, chicken, and alligator combo. You can actually get alligator here, guys. Um, shrimp, Parmesan scampi. Popcorn shrimp, um, tacos, pud bowls, pud pucker, sandwiches, burgers, Philly cheesesteaks. And this one right here is the interesting one. The Fudinator, our biggest burger ever. One and a half pounds of burger layered with all American cheese, chili, hickory, smoked bacon, sauteed um, lettuce, tomato, onion, pickle. Take the... You can take the challenge, eat the tire with fries and coleslaw in 30 minutes and get a free t-shirt. 30 bucks. They actually got a gluten-free menu here. They got all kinds of gluten-free options, I've noticed. Um, okay, so our food's here. I ordered a cheeseburger, bacon cheeseburger. And there's the sides there. Come with a little bit of coleslaw, seasoned fries. Now, guys, get a load of this. Don ordered the nachos. <laughs> the thing is huge. Look at it. Look at it on the table. Don, what did you do? I don't know. It, just, it happened. It, it, it happened. It's that is like huge, guys. Totally huge. I'm gonna show Chris's food real quick here. He had the. Uh, That's the chicken. The chicken. It's yep. topped with bacon and Swiss cheese. Yeah, Hush Puppies, uh, 
Oh, you got some mac, 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 the mac looks and good. And that's supposed to be pineapple coleslaw that came with it. Oh, wow. And then Mindy got uh, a burger. just a burger, yeah. Oh, that's cool, guys. All right, Ron, like Ron, you're, that's crazy. But guys, I don't know. I mean, things huge. Look at it. <laughs> they played a joke on you, didn't they? Yeah. Look at that. It's huge. It's like a, it's like a volcano of nachos. Um, I had the coleslaw. It, that that was real good. I want to start digging in. The Caesar fries are pretty good too. Okay, so Dawn ordered the huge nachos that were more than she could ever eat. Um, that was fifteen ninety nine. The um, bacon cheeseburger that I had was fourteen ninety nine. We had waters, and our total is thirty three dollars. Well, look at this. There's a wall of beer cans, old beer cans. <laughs> Different types of. So yeah, all kinds of beer cans you see on the on the walls. So they got a a gator show going on. What's that? One hundred alligators a year, eighty teeth on average. That's eight thousand teeth in this pond right now. So again, rule number one: don't jump in. They also have a swimming goggle that goes side to side, so when they swim underwater, they can protect their eyes and they can see underwater. It slides across, all right? Now, if you guys want to get a good indication, then brain that's closed across their eye. Good question. The first sound you're going to hear if you are too close to an alligator is a hiss, all right? Just to let you know, they're going to hiss at you through their nostrils and let you know that you're in their territory. Now, alligators will use that same hiss to let other alligators know that get out of my territory. Boat down here in Destin, bigger boat, bigger wake. All right, bigger gators alert smaller gators that don't come in my area because I want the best female. Low airplanes make the same frequency that alligators do. So when we have a flyover sometimes, our alligators start bellowing and look up and talking to the airplanes. It's pretty cool to see. You might have or your kids might have you can purchase photo tickets all throughout the day to get your picture holding a baby. Prehistoric crocodile skull. Huh. So anyways, uh, yeah, they got a whole thing here. Look at all these. Look at these guys. You can see his, he almost looks fake until you look underneath his uh, neck there. You can see him breathing there. Wow, that is... That is something. And all his little brothers and sisters. Hey, buddy. You like that heat lamp? You know, I'll bask it over here in the heat lamp. Pearl. The amazing albino alligator. So this is Pearl. There she is. Pearl the albino alligator. This is how you take your alligator for a walk. You put a chain around its neck and go for a walk. This guy is huge. That alligator probably needs to go see the dentist. <laughs> wow, there's so many gators. Gator on top of gator on top of gator. They got a, a bar up here. Pretty cool. Lots of different things you can do here. Um, they actually got gators and 
They got a little kids area here they can play. But um, yeah. Got a stage here, looks like they have bands and stuff play. Really cool decorations. That shark there has got a hand in his mouth. <laughs> but uh wow. Fun, fun, right? Fun Fudge puckers. Fudge puckers. Including Pearl, the amazing Don't albino alligator, and much more at our Crocodile Pearl. Reptile Museum located in Love Fudge Puckers. That was fun. Bucks, bowling alley, fish. Look at the ball returns. Ball return over there is a shark. This one's an alligator. Isn't that cool? Look at the ceiling here. It's all it's different types of like fish and barracuda. There's a marlin up there. Sea turtle. It's like you're uh, bowling in a fish tank. Got a bar here. Pretty amazing. Shark up there. So we actually like leaving the Smoky Mountains to check out other things in other areas. And this is another one of those places where I could see this one day coming to the Great Smoky Mountains. So we do like to leave the area to see what possibly could happen. Also, when we get word of new things that are happening in the Smokies, it might have already been done somewhere else. And someone would say, hey, they're gonna build a new Uncle Buck's bowling alley. And we'd say, yes, we've been to one. Like here in uh, Dustin, so really cool, isn't it? What do you think? I think it's awesome. Yeah. yeah. So you got an alligator, an octopus, another alligator, and a shark. Anyways, this is a really cool bowling alley because they actually change the graphics down here and the fish actually look like they're swimming around and, and what have you. But it feels like you're bowling in a fish tank. today here in Destin, Florida. Guys, if you like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. Uh, please subscribe so you don't miss any of these up. Road trip adventures. We're going to have plenty of road trip adventures just around the corner. Also, we're going to be back in the Smokies very shortly, and we're going to have plenty of Smoky Mountain adventures. Also, if you guys haven't, check out our friend, Chris About Tees. Yeah, he was the guy, and Mindy was the gal that was hanging out with us tonight. 
And guys, definitely um, have a great night. And thanks we'll, for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you.